Bam! What's happening guys? It's me again, Honest Dave, coming to you today with another EDC update. Now I'm sorry I haven't posted any videos in about three weeks now. There was a family emergency. I kind of had to get out of here quickly. I really didn't want to do anything while I was doing it all. So I'm back. I hope you guys have no problem with me being gone this long. And the videos will continue on as normally. Now, like I said, today we're going to be doing an EDC update of what I've been carrying. I got some new stuff, some old stuff, yada, yada, yada. So let's get started with the simple stuff. First of all, my camouflage trucker's cap with my red, white, and blue fish hook. My Harley Davidson prescription glasses. Not really much to say there. I have a new one on my necklace, which is my Sinister Picks Iron Cross Guitar Pick. As some of you may know, I do play guitar, electric and acoustic, and I have kind of a collection of guitar picks. If you ever want to see anything on these, I've had one guy suggest I do a video on these guitar picks line if you want to see it. Look into that. Two of those. A new watch. A leather digital watch. Of course, I had to punch out some new holes because I have a little bird wrist, unfortunately. Digital and regular. Says the time, date, alarm, all the good stuff. I like it, but it's about 12 bucks at Walmart. Still rocking the paracord bracelet, of course. Of course, the key ring doesn't really change that much. New bandolier, same old keys, my Dylan shopping card when I was an employee, and a Victoria Knox classic keychain with the knife, fingernail cleaner and file, scissors, toothpick, and of course. Tweezers. Still rocking the same brown Georgie's wallet. I have put some new stuff in here. Of course, I have my library cards, my shopper's card, uh, hunting license, fishing license, business cards. Just a little bug out bag I keep in there with band aids, razor blade. Needles, fish hooks, extra toothpick for my Victorian Ox. A UST wallet, credit card, multi tool. I still have the Wallet Ninja multi tool. I really do enjoy that one. And a Sinclair card sharp knife. Nice to keep a spare little knife in your wallet. Still rocking my blue Streamlight 65 lumen flashlight. I do want to buy a new flashlight, I just really like this design. That I like the room. An Uzi number six tactical pen. Of course, you know, can be used as a pen, of course. As a self-defense weapon if necessary. It's got a glass breaker. And a handcuff key. About 20 bucks, made of aluminum. I would suggest you checking them out. You might like them. Some OHM cigars, cigar lows, whatever they want to call them. I like them. A 2015 polished Zippo. 
As some of you may know, I do collect Zippos. And if you'd like to see those sometime, I can be willing to do a video on those too. For a work knife, I'm rocking the Victorian Ox Recruit. Comes with a, with a can opener and a small flathead. A bottle opener and a large flathead. A small pin blade. The main knife. Tweezers again. And a toothpick. Very good tool. Probably the best 13 bucks ever spent on a knife. And now for the main blade. I've been rocking a Spyderco fully serrated Endura. I know some people think the fully serrated knife is completely useless, but. They would, in fact, be wrong. I really need to sharpen this one up better, but one of the I actually do think it is a very good knife. I'm really starting to love the Endura series. Huh? The irony is my very first video, someone suggested me this knife and it took me this long to get one. Although I do want to replace it with the plain edge blade, or a half serrated, half plain edge. Or probably just pick up both. Now you're probably wondering, why do I enjoy this knife so much? It is about the right blade size I like to carry, about a three and a quarter, a three and three quarter inch blade. Huh? So it's a very, it is a large knife. Good grip. Nice handles, strong lockup, four-way positional pocket clip, I love that, and the spidey hole, crap, cut that, no, no like I'm saying, the spidey hole, I love it, I finally get why people do love this spidey hole, because this thing is just great in my opinion. Of course, you always got the old spidey drop. And like I said, I do want to replace this with a full plain edge. So if anyone's got one out there that they're looking to get rid of, you know, hit me up. But yeah. Well, guys, that is what I've been EDCing for a while. I am planning on buying a handgun soon. A four, It's going to be a 45... Citadel Compact, 1911, and when I do pick that up, it may take a while, because unfortunately I have lost my job, so I'm going to have to wait a while to get that, you know, hopefully find a new job here in town, we'll see what happens, and thank you guys for watching, like I said I apologize for the long hiatus I've been gone, I hope you can forgive me for that. Y'all rock on. This is Honest Dave signing out. Bye, and remember, be humble and kind.